Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and I'm back again with another fun project this time and we are going to do today is called as toxicity classification using tensorflow.js so yes guys this is another short video tutorial about tensorflow.js in which we are going to use a pre-trained model which is called as toxicity model to basically know if a particular comment or if a particular sentence is toxic or not so guys as we all know that on internet on twitter on social media there are a lot of comments which people make and most of them are having a lot of negativity and toxicity in them so today uh, we just will be taking one such comment from a famous personality uh, who has tweeted a lot and we will just uh, take this comment put it here and click on this button which is called as classify and now let's just see if this comment is toxic or not and yes guys you see here that this comment does hold a toxic value majorly because it is an insult to somebody so guys let's use this uh, same html page and now let's add a positive comment like you are looking beautiful today right and let me click on classify and let's see if this comment is being classified as toxic or not and you guys see here that the toxicity level of this comment is definitely zero and hence this comment is not a negative comment but it is a positive comment so guys you see and i hope you enjoyed this short demo and uh, i know that most of you would be wanting to know how i created this example and i assure you that it is really really simple to create so guys if you like my videos and you like all this content i make and you want to support me please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for further notifications and i will not delay this tutorial anymore and without any delay let's get started so guys the first thing if you want to create an html page like this you first have to write an html script right so basically what i will do is i will go to this folder so first of all this folder is an empty folder and we are going to create an html page here from scratch so let me go to my notepad plus plus and uh, uh, what i will do is i will just create a new file here and let me save it as index.html in my tensorflow classification folder okay let me save this and now what i will do is i will just create here html tag pretty quickly and i will just create here a form in which we will be having basically one input field and one submit button so i will just write here input type equals to text and my value will be here uh, please provide uh, my value will be definitely empty and i will just write here an id like my text and i will just then close this value and i will have an input type as submit and uh, let's just have one div here stating that we just basically want to enter a sentence so please enter a sentence okay so guys this is my html form which is uh, pretty quickly created and let me just open it with chrome and you see that i have an input field here so please enter a sentence and then there is this submit button and this input field here is a uh, field with an id my text okay so guys the first thing which we have to do in tensorflow is we have to import a tensorflow model okay because we are using here pre-trained model so we have to import a tensorflow model and we also have to import tensorflow js as well so guys this is the uh, uh, script tags of uh, tensorflow js and tensorflow toxicity model uh, scripts so if you are using node.js you can definitely you can definitely uh, uh, import using the npm commands if you are using yarn you can use like that as well uh, but here i'm not using any fancy framework i'm using simple html and that is why i'm only importing these two script tags and definitely 
<clears throat> now my model is imported but i have to use that model to basically classify my sentence is that correct right so for that i need to create another uh, script of my own so i will just write here script and i will just uh, write the name of my script as index.js and then i will just close this script tag so definitely uh, i have to create this file uh, called as index.js uh, it the, it has to be in the same place as that of my html file because you see the path i gave here is not having any uh, any other directories mentioned so now i have my index.js file guys i hope until now it is clear so until now we did nothing we just did a html page and we imported our tensorflow model and our tensorflow js with these two script tags that is it guys it was so simple until now and even after this it is going to be a really simple so guys the first thing which you have to uh, mention here is called as a threshold and the threshold here i am mentioning as 0.9 so guys what this threshold actually means guys this threshold only just means one thing that this is the probability of toxicity in a comment so if a probability of a toxicity in comment is more than this threshold value that is more than 90% we will say that that comment is toxic otherwise we will not classify it as a toxic comment so that is why this variable is being uh, simply being uh, declared here now i will just create a function called as classify function and we are going to call this function in our uh, input field okay so once you have created this function the next thing i have want to do is i want to load my model right so i already have imported this model here oh sorry so i already have imported this model here so i will just copy this uh, word and write here toxicity dot load and this load function will just take one argument called as threshold which we have defined above and then you can now use this model okay so all i have to do is write here toxicity dot load and then and now i can use this model okay so guys now i have this model object with me and i want to have my sentence right so my sentence here is document dot get element by id get element by id by id and the id of my element i will copy from here so this is the id of my element and now i have gotten access to my text field so this uh, variable will basically contain the text value of my input field so i have got the text value here now using this model object i will just cla classify this basically sentence so i will just have to pass here model dot classify sentence and once you have classified this sentence in then you will uh, get a result of predictions okay so you have your predictions here and once you have gotten this predictions object then you can simply print it okay so here what i am going to do is i am just going to console dot log these predictions and we will just see how these predictions look like okay so let me just fix this so console dot log predictions okay yes guys so guys that was it okay this is the code and let me just try to oh yeah one more thing we first have to call this classify function definitely okay so we have input type submit and uh, value equals to submit and here we will write on click equals to and now we will simply pass our 
our uh, classify method okay so this is my classify method and now let's refresh this and uh, first thing is i will do an f12 so that whatever uh, prediction is printed on the console i should be able to see it so let me just add a negative sentence for now so for example i have entered a sentence called as you suck and i click on submit here and let's wait for one yeah you see uh we have already gotten our predictions guys so basically this line uh, console.log predictions was basically printing our predictions on the console and you see that when i entered this sentence you suck then we got these predictions printed so let's just inspect these predictions okay so so the first thing is let's check the toxicity value so we had this label called as toxicity and what are the results of this label you will see that basically results array contains two things probabilities and the match so you see the match value is true here which basically means that this sentence is toxic and what are the probabilities you see that all the probabilities are in decimal point and we have this probability which is definitely definitely higher than 90% and that's this why we have labeled this sentence as toxic value true so guys if you also inspect other labels like if i cl click here insult you will see that insult of match is also true if you click on obscene in that case you will see that the match is null so that means this sentence is not obscene but it is definitely an insult to somebody and that is why it is being classified as a toxic comment so guys did you see it we just wrote like a handful of code only three to four lines of code and a very very simple html page and you were actually able to make a very classic uh, tensorflow classifier which is taking the uh, sentences doing some natural language processing in the back end and then it is giving you the result so wasn't that amazing guys wasn't that so simple so cool and still so great so guys i hope you like this video and you learned something from it and you actually got interested in the field of data science and machine learning using these simple examples guys if you please uh, i i recommend everyone to please try this this example i will be linking the code in the description as well if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and share this video like this video as well do hit the bell icon for further notifications until next time thank you so much everyone and bye bye